It's one of his favorite songs because he knows that that's my song for him. Mm. So ganun kasi yun eh, pagka alam niyang kanya, favorite song na niya. I sang it in one of my concerts some 12 years ago sa Music Museum. Mm -hmm. I did a parang acoustic na uso noon, na usong kasi noon yung mga acoustic acoustic show. So I did that and actually hindi naman namin story yun mag-ama kaya lang whenever I would hear that song it would always remind me of him. You were in the middle of a press conference. Yeah, I was I was doing a press conference. Mm -hmm. And you got the call. Right after I finished actually, I got mm -hmm. a call from my sister. Pero the night before, actually yung morning na yun kasama pa nila ako eh. Sunday mga 11 o'clock actually I got to the hospital mga mga 12 hanggang mga 6:30 I was with them. Kasi wala nang gising eh, ako lang ang gising eh. So ako yung kasama ni, ni mama at ni papa sa hospital ng time yun. I went home lang to, to get a little bit of rest and to uh, prepare for the press mm -hmm. con. Tapos, uh, I got a call na he passed na. I keep saying na God gave us a little bit of time to prepare. Mm -hmm. If this happened last year, I would have been a mess. Mm -hmm. Actually, the whole family was a mess last year. It, actually, to think nga na this year siya pumanaw, yung last year namin yung pinakamabigat na year ever na na-experience ko sa buong buhay namin family. Kasi yun yung he was getting sick and he almost died mm -hmm. and we were in the ICU for two months. So mm -hmm. It was the most difficult ano, talaga, time in our lives mm -hmm. last year. So last year I prayed, sabi ko, Lord, I'm not ready. I don't think the whole family is ready either. So give us a little bit of time. And he did. He gave us a little bit of time and he showed us pa, God showed us pa na why he needs to go na rin. Kasi, Wala eh, when he never really recovered you know. from the operation. Mm -hmm. I mean, he did, he got well, mm -hmm. pero it's not the same na yun. It's no? not the same, tsaka parang ayo na rin niya, yung parang pagod na siya, pagod na siya. And then, till ito yung mga last few days niya, especially, he kept complaining already that he's tired. And then he wanted to go home to Bulacan. That's all he kept saying. Mm -hmm. Uwi na tayo, uwi na tayo. For my birthday, we're going to Hong Kong because she kept asking for that. I want to go to Hong Kong when Papa was sick. Because it's tiring. It's very, you know, emotionally. Yes, it's very draining for her. She, she. I have to hand it to her now. They were together for 44 years. That's no. 44, 45 years. And she was, she, she was with him when she, when she was 21. And he was 31. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. wala siyang ibang alam Bone in her life. life niya, no? Parang love birds. With, yeah. oh, oh, but to be with him. Silang mga the, the issues. Na, uh, lahat naman. Mm -hmm. But they stuck together. They stuck together. And she never left him. Mm -hmm. Especially when he got sick now. She was with him. 